And tonight, SpaceX is preparing for the first launch of a new rocket from the Kennedy Space Center. The company plans to deliver a communication satellite for Bangladesh atop the Falcon 9 Block 5. Channel 9's Melanie Holt live on the Space Coast for tonight. And Mel, you're still waiting to see if they'll test fire that rocket tonight. We have been watching for that plume of smoke from the pad for hours now, but today's window of opportunity doesn't close until 8 p.m. tonight. A SpaceX Falcon 9 Block 5 sits vertical on pad 39A at NASA's Kennedy Space Center, ready for its inaugural launch next week. But first, the company must complete a test firing on the pad ahead of its mission to deliver a communication satellite for Bangladesh atop SpaceX's most reusable rocket yet. This one is designed to be reused 10 times. And so it's going to be a very significant upgrade in capability that they, they're always innovating and adding new features. But I think they're hoping that this one, they've kind of settled on a mature technology that they can ride for a considerable period of time. And this upgraded configuration is also the one expected to lift U.S. astronauts up to the International Space Station aboard the SpaceX Crew Dragon, possibly before the end of this year. This is yet another step in our efforts to return humans back into space from here on at the Cape. And everybody's looking forward to that, uh, except some folks in Russia, but that, that's a good thing. A fleet of upgraded Falcon 9s also forwards the goal of rapid rocket reusability. They're talking about flying this thing a lot. If everything goes as planned, the launch of that communication satellite is scheduled to happen no earlier than Monday. We are live here at NASA's Kennedy Space Center. Melanie Holtz, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.